This is for. This is not for stirring paint. Ooh, it's a bug on it. Girls, just looking at me. Can't be your man. And that's the time live. Money and pretty women. Baddest bras in the city. That's all I'm here. That's the sound. See, it's so cute. Just can't do it. It's into your heart, you know. Sometimes it makes me wanna cry. You hear me crying? Oh, girl! <laughs> this <laughs> this stuff don't flew all across the floor. Listen, put that there, and then it says you wanna take this here and just squiggly glee. And then, oh, it's so strong, girl. I'm not gonna do it. I was just thinking about it. I'm not gonna do it. Ah, oh, it's on me! See the baddies? Would you put the soap on the left or the right? No, 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 Girl, it's crooked. No, 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 I know y'all know about this. It makes it makes you like that. And there you have it, folks. <laughs> girl, it's giving suave essential. Y'all didn't remind me what the girl is lighting look good. Girl, this lighting look good. About the jokes, D side be cracking, and I just put suave so essential <laughs> in my in my lotion dispenser. What is it? Suave I don't like this though for my pump because it's giving leftover residue and it won't even pump. Look. Okay. It's giving the girls eraser marks. I erased my answer two times and I had to do the paper like this. <laughs> Jokes. I hate when I have to get disclaimers. I'm cracking jokes because I know y'all be in the comments like, just don't have guests over your house who would talk about your lotion. I wouldn't and ain't. But it's sticky. Oh my god, it's sticky! I need to stop yelling because it's an echo and I keep forgetting that. Girl. Okay, let's go put it up. This man on YouTube left his up for 24 hours before he even put it on there. And ain't. <laughs> It's very much giving. I'm anxious and ready to use it. It's very much <laughs> That's where that's coming from. The caffeine I had this morning. I just I just figured it out. Too much. She had too much. Girl, I gotta make sure it's up there. I'm scared. Girl, it's very much giving classy. Pump, pump, pump. Pump, pump. Okay, the man said you press it. What that do when you cover it though? 
because it's very much giving it's not working okay let's try this one cover release press cover release press okay let me get the instructions because it's not ready okay i forgot how to do it hold on okay so that's how much soap we get two pumps over here let's see what we got it's ready baby <laughs> girl my lotion is giving the girl suave essentials mm -hmm. you have to prime it to like make the soap come out and you have to keep pumping it to make the lotion come out so i tested it out and it's so sticky
that's the one that's just five rounds per year. For the, you said that's for the shrubs and what else? Could you repeat that? It, it's called shrub and ornamental. Shrub and ornamental. Okay, and you said that'll be 65 for five? Yes, ma'am, for five rounds. We come out five times a year. Yes, ma'am. The phone call that I just had basically was with, um, well, I won't say the company name. Certain things I try not to say because it's just protection for me, I guess. Um, privacy, protection, all of that kind of stuff. If you want to be a YouTuber, always remember to still make sure that you're keeping yourself safe by not showing too much, not revealing things outside too much, not showing like dresses and things like that when you open packages. Always be careful of those kinds of things. Even if you think, oh, I have 100 subscribers, whatever the case may be, at some point your channel is going to grow. And some people are going to be a little more curious, a little more um, obligated feeling, if you will, a little more invasive. Um, regardless, I know sometimes people say, oh, well, when you decide to be a YouTuber, you're exposing yourself to this and that and whatever the case may be. No, you're not. No, you're not. People are not allowed to be, they're allowed to be entitled to more because we can't, you can't control how other people feel or what they may want to um, dig into outside of what you share. But always do your best when you cut your camera on to protect yourself. So anyway, um, <laughs> that was so random. That's like a workout. Painting is a workout. When I got here, there was like a folder left for me. Um, with lots of just different things. I did have my agent inquire about like, oh, what internet did they have? Hey, what cable did they have? Things like that. Not for like nosy reasons, but um, good service, good quality service reasons, good connection, all of that. Cause you know, sometimes different cable companies, different internet companies don't really work well in certain areas. And so you don't want to go like back and forth trying to decide like, oh, I had all of this installed to find out that it's slow, different things like that. Because then, you know, they're hooking up stuff to the house, all of that. Plus, if you find out what a person had in the home prior to you, it means that installation is super easy. Like how y'all saw that I was able to just basically plug in my own internet and everything because those connections were already here. So if I switch companies, they have to come out and do different connections, all of that. And with COVID and everything, it just meant that with the self-installation, there was one less person I had to have to come in here and take a chance on stuff like that. So basically the call that I just made is for termite, pest, and the lawn care solutions. I'm gonna attempt to keep the same service that was already here at the home because it means that that specific company already knows this yard. If they've been taking care of the lawn care, the pest control, the termite solutions, all of that kind of stuff. Not saying it's not any termites. Obviously, you get home um, home inspections, termite inspection, all of that kind of stuff is done when you're purchasing a home. So you get those reports back and everything. But it's the maintenance of making sure that you don't get pests, you don't get termite, things like that. So um, basically, I love the way that the yard looks, and it's it makes sense to just keep the same people who have been caring for the yard because the grass is like really nice um, on here type of grass. It says it's Bermuda, it gives me my square feet in the front yard, the square feet in the back, total square feet, all of that. So um, I basically just called because I already had this proposal right here. And she said something about that they probably wouldn't be able to schedule me in. They had the yard like freshly done right before I moved in basically. Because when I got here, I could tell that the yard was like freshly done, which I absolutely loved. Um, that was very considerate of them. But it's just like, I wish I would have gone as far as to do like some sort of transfer of service to where I could just basically pick it back up. That's what I was telling the lady. I'm like, this address, this specific, not the same person, obviously I'm a different person, but this home was already serviced with you all. I wanted to pick it back up basically and just continue paying for everything. So now I'm kind of out of the loop of being fit within the schedule of the homes that they tend to. And she was just saying how they only have like a crew and a half right now. So I guess that's the thing about scheduling me in. Um, well, they'll be able to do everything she did say, except for like getting the yard cut and all of that. So they can come out for like pest control, the lawn care. Lawn care being like the maintenance of making sure you don't get weeds and things, not, necess weeds and things, not necessarily cutting the grass, but the upkeep of weeds not growing um, and just like bugs and all of that being in your grass and stuff. So I definitely am still gonna let them do that. Initial fee is $2.95 and then the renewal fee is $1.95. But the rest of these are pretty decent, especially because it's like you don't really wanna cut corners. The pest control and things like that, that's definitely something I don't want to just have taken off of the list. She's gonna work on the paperwork and all of that. She told me that she would just give me a call back. 
which I tell her no rush. I understand like people, you know, when you're at work, you have more than one person to tend to with things. So I just told her whenever she was able to get back to me, then that would be fine. So that's the update on that. Still waiting on the paint to dry. Um, it takes like an hour in between. So in between that, y'all know I like to multitask. So I'm coming in here, importing footage for the next maintenance vlog. This one is gonna be maintenance vlog number four. Like a first week maintenance, like the duct cleaning, um, different services that I had when we first got into the home where they came to clean the carpet. We had the uh, air ducts and all of that vacuumed out, the HVAC cleaning, the filters changed, all of that kind of stuff. So that's what that one is gonna consist of. So I'm just digging through all of these different SD cards. I don't wanna waste them. Uh, just looking for everything. I do have a new SD card now and it started me off, I want to say, with about 16 hours. So uh, once I get all of these cleaned up, I won't have to buy a new one anymore. But for the time being, they just kind of full. So my footage is in more than one spot because it just kind of is. Because when I was running out of space, I was like, okay, let me grab another card. So I just have to search the different ones to find it. And then once this little hour is over, I'm going to go back out there, do that last, hopefully the last coat of paint. So that's how my day is going and I'm drinking on this spring water that my, if y'all saw the vacation vlog that my parents filmed when they went to Arkansas, yeah, they have like wells in Arkansas where you can get like fresh water like straight from the well. So my parents brought us some back. I just drink on it every now and then cause it's delicious. I'm glad my nails aren't done yet while I'm painting cause I did get like a few little spots on me even with the gloves, but it's okay. Mm. You don't realize how much you can probably taste like, ooh, that's good lighting. How you can probably taste like different um, things that are just naturally in water to keep it clean until you drink spring water. Like when I drink this, I can tell the difference from if I drink it from my sink. What time is it? 2.30. And I've been going since, I think when I showed y'all that first coat, it was like 12.30, but I got up this morning at like 8.30, so. I'm feeling productive. Guys, I separated my bad strawberries from the good ones. I don't want to throw these out. Well, I'm throwing these out. And these bananas are close to going bad as well. I remember seeing an old comment where y'all was like, oh, don't throw out your fruit. Blend it up. <laughs> so I've never tried it before when y'all told me, but today is that day before I throw it out. Don't get used to me making smoothies because this is not that channel, but I just don't want this to go to waste. And I'm about to use this magic bullet. Give it a seven out of 10. It's quite natural, quite sweet. And I was at least able to do something with this fruit. Ooh, my footage is imported. Import complete. I was at least able to do something with this fruit instead of letting it go bad. It's 340. I'm getting ready to do this last coat for the day, hopefully, so that I can start on other things. I did that second coat off camera just to not bore you all. Um, and I'm finding like, since that drawer fell out, I'm finding all of my stuff in the back. Oh, I didn't tell y'all the drawer fell out. This one fell out. Get off of my thing, little fly. So some of my clothes, I can see them. That's the reason that one wouldn't push back all the way. Some of my gym clothes. Girl, my waist trainer, I've been looking for that. So second coat, this is what we got. I can still kind of see it bleeding through a little bit. What is that? No. It's not perfect, but it beats paying $1,500 for one, like what I saw on Wayfair. <laughs> Let's get done. And when it was cold, it's hot in these pants, but I don't want to get it on me, so I figured the more covered I could be, the better.
lives are going to get past. I'm going to have to break the flow. How am I going to change this man? I'm going to have to break the flow. It's been flowing in one direction for two. I just mostly spent the morning editing and I actually filmed a video, edited a video, and it's up on YouTube. The reason all of these products are right here is because I need to be able to talk about the products, tell y'all next up I'm taking blah blah blah. That way I can give y'all like exact names and all of that. So I'm getting ready to carry everything back into the bathroom and put it away now. My blue shower and skincare routine if you all want to check that out it took me a while like a good while to do the voiceover because i hadn't done one in a while so i really was kind of like struggling a little bit youtube has been taking a while with the process and lately i don't like that and don't understand why oh wait 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 there we go it's ready okay so it is unlisted meaning no one can see it unless i give them the link like if it was sponsored by a company or something that's how they're able to view it before your subscribers view it monetization is on restrictions none so it's 4 43 i'm going to try to hurry up and get the thumbnail and everything ready so that i can make it public at five i'm feeling super proud of myself to have been this productive today i feel like as far as getting things done around the house i've been very productive with that but as far as like the rest of my life, I felt kind of like I, well, not to say I wasn't taking showers and things like that, but to just be aware of myself, aware of, uh, how do I explain what I mean? Maybe I'll do it in the chit chat, but the way that I encourage and motivate you all, and I'm always talking about like, oh, make time for yourself and this and that and blah, blah, blah. Basically, I just felt like I've been doing like house related things to be productive. But outside of that, I hadn't really been like, dedicating to like me time i guess like yeah i'm taking a shower but i'm not taking the shower with any kind of like special attention given to me taking the shower like spending extra time maybe doing like nail or things like that it's like taking the shower just to hurry up and get in bed type of thing versus you actually really spending time with yourself i don't know if that makes sense or not but i couldn't sleep so i had got up kind of early i was like i'm about to take a walk and just like walk the neighborhood and see what's what and i thoroughly enjoyed doing that it was my first time taking a walk in the new neighborhood really enjoyed it don't know if i'll like continue to do it every morning but um i really want to work on rebuilding a new morning routine because i currently don't have one i'm trying to line these products up in a cute way for the thumbnail basically <laughs> y'all will see that um video by the time you all see this vlog i don't know i was like hold on destiny pause for a second sis <laughs> and i had to just really get to spend some time with myself so i feel like that's what i've done all day i haven't really taken any phone calls didn't bother talking to people actually yes i did yes i did i didn't i guess by phone calls i mean i didn't call anyone um like lounging on the phone all day not being productive or sometimes i'm on the phone while i'm doing things either way hold on let me let me finish this and i'll come back okay so it's about 4 59 i'm getting ready to go ahead and make this video public i went ahead and saved the thumbnail i'm doing this on my phone since i made it on my phone it's quicker to just upload it right here and it is now public since it's five o'clock, the video is only about 10 minutes long. I'm going to go back and forth commenting back to people at least until like 5.30. So yeah, I just basically sit here and just keep like refreshing the screen, chatting back with you all. I'm trying to think of something. Oh, the end screen over here, end card. The preset one that I usually use is right there. So I just kind of click to the end and I'm gonna just select this and change it to, if I just search for pink, to probably yep there it is the pink shower routine and then i'm gonna search purple real quick and i'm able to search these words basically because i tag them anyway and it'll help me to link the other routines that i've done at the end of the video and then i make sure everything lines up 
it for you all. Okay, I gotta go now, cause I gotta edit. Bye. Perfect. And then I'm gonna just say that and the video is out. So the little checklist that's over here, it will tell you like, this is vidIQ basically. It'll tell you to add a card to the video. So I'm going to just reference, I got a call. I'm gonna finish this, be right back. right here I see my phone on it sometimes and yeah I bought another one because I do already have one but I wanted to have one for when I'm upstairs and one for when I'm downstairs that way I don't have to move it around too much and it can let up and down 
like that, depending on the height that you would need. And then you could actually store things, obviously. I had it in the film room, that's why this lash is right here. Um, I'll link it down below, I got it from Amazon. It'll be in the, probably in the home decor organization section. So yeah. And that, my folks, is a clean kitchen. Love it. Now I just need to sweep and mop again. And I kept that little dirty towel right there um, so that I can kind of like do a second scrubbing under there. But my little first run through today did it really good. So once I get a candle in here, I'll be good. I'm going to take a break from vlogging, y'all, so I can go a little faster and I'll talk to y'all in a minute. We got some labels on the back. Uh, 4, 8, 12, 16. So this is 16 fluid ounces and it basically just says to fill it up past the jets with hot water and then let it run for 15 minutes and I'm supposed to add in four ounces of it so I'm gonna pour down to where it gets to like this 12 right here and then I know I added four. Okay, so that's about four. <laughs> that don't seem like a lot at all. I just got it on my hands. Okay, let's cut her on. And yes, my decor is already right here because I tried those TikTok hacks. Oh, I'm reaching on the wrong side. So, we're gonna see if the TikTok hacks work. If this brings out more junk in 15 minutes. Mm. <laughs> Girl, I already see two little things right there. Oh, uh-uh. I don't see much, but we'll let it run. Okay, so it's only been about two minutes, y'all. And look at that. <laughs> Let me see. Yeah, that's what I got. <laughs> he talking about I'm a year late. I ain't have a jet tub. <laughs> he talking about a nigga been bathing with jets. Well, I didn't have one. Huh? Two years late, man. Nigga, Ben and it's a cool as a toe. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm in one now. Finna be anyway. Right there, right, Snoop. Look at Snoop. Hey, Snoop. Snoop got to come out and see who you talking to. I want them. Fish at the fair. I bought a fish tank. I'm going to put them in here. That's what I want to get. Girl, not me leaving the refrigerator open. <laughs> I was going to get something to eat. You need to be in that video. Uh, you could re record it, yeah. <laughs> Very often, I be flossing coochie hanging off me. Hey, let me wipe my screen now. What's all these messages they sending? There we go. Now I'm clear giving iPhone quality. Took my morning walk, you know. You finna shoot a video? For that, LeGreg said a Chrome 40 caliber is shoot missiles though. <laughs> Stop that noise, LeGreg! Sorry, I'm loud this morning. I had a little caffeine, folks. Snoop, wanna go to cake Look at Snoop. Hey, Snoop. I'm finna cook bacon and eggs, Snoop. You like bacon and eggs, Snoop? Yeah, 
You said what? How long the fish gonna live? You had them floating in the bag before you put them in the water. They say your connection poor. Bacon and eggs. Huh? I'm finna fix me some cheese toast too. I said I need to stop eating that cheese toast every day, eating that bread. Yeah, you gotta come out here. I got a lot of new stuff since the last time you was here. I said I got a lot of new stuff since the last time you was here. Yeah, you can. I'm here. With a couple of guys, they, yay, in my neighborhood. <laughs> Your connection bad since you left the house. Yeah, somebody should with me. You can do a little bread. Do an IHOP two by two by two. Two pancakes, two eggs, two bacon strips. But I'm gonna just do the cheese toast instead. I gotta call some people back. I be ignoring people when I'm talking to uh, my family. <laughs> well, I, depending on who I'm talking to, it don't even gotta be my family, but I ignore like, you know how you get another call while you're on a call? So yeah, I gotta call them back. But I don't feel like it right now, so they can wait. Stay tuned.